Welcome to this series where we are playing Reforged Eden for Imperium Galactic Survival. Now we spent the last couple of uh, parts hacking through this abandoned bunker and what I want to do in this part is finally trigger the core and get this over and done with so we can go and do something else because I must admit I'm getting a little bit fed up with it. Now before we get started, I'd like to say a big thank you for all your comments and feedback. As usual, you guys give me a lot to think about. Now, I did get one comment where someone was pointing out that is it really worth hacking through all these uh, um, bug uglies and that to, for the loot that's in this place. And I think when it comes to loot in this game, it depends on what phase of the game you're in. Because, like, I've done the Dread Start, so I don't have that much. If I show you here, we come to... I'm still in range of the capital. Oh come into here you can see I, st I don't have an excessive amount of loot mainly because i haven't been able to mine and i think this is the difference that's in the wrong place so it's that and that move that that oh, we've got here small upgrade oh the small upgrade kit i'm not exactly sure what we can do with that but i think i'll put that in general supplies so from my point of view it the loot in here probably is worth something but if you're saying in the mid to late game maybe the loot in this poi wouldn't be so such a a valuable um thing to accomplish but of course when you get to the mid to the late game um you're taking down some of these harder pois more for the fun of it rather than the loot and all the challenge i suppose is a better description so so it still is very much a matter of personal choice now before we um, move forward the thing i need to mention is the fact that this um, POI doesn't actually have a core for the player to actually destroy. The core's very well hidden. But what we've got to do is trigger a certain sequence of events which will then actually cause the core to self destruct. And then that actually allows us to take over the POI. Now, as part, now in this part, I'm what I'm going to do is show you a bit of a back door which I've forgotten completely all about. And if I'm going to need some explosives, I think we're probably still there. Because if you come to the back of this room here, let me show you the back of this room. What you see in this corner, you see there's a curved block here. And I don't think there's any other blocks. It's only just this curved block here. And what that will do is give us a, an, a, an access to the central room that we spent a, lot, a whole part, or two parts, I think, trying to get access to previously what you see is that will now destroy this block if we come in here because there's bound to be uh, a bug ugly down here now the place we got to get into is in here so it's not allowed I don't know how thick I mean this is only 240 thing I've never been too sure of is whether if we just blast our way in there we can get access maybe uh maybe we could give that a go now but the first thing we got to do is get in here and I don't know if you guys can see it. it's right see it's coming towards us right down the bottom there is a turret and it's a stun turret and what we got to do is Destroy it. I mean, this is where a rocket launcher would come in. Now, a stun turret won't kill you, but it will get you killed in the sense that if you get stunned in a, a corridor like this where things are happening, I, I think we're in range. I think we've got it now. Yep. Yeah. Haha. <laughs> Is to say, these corridors are full of interesting uh, creatures. <laughs> um, I think around here. Ah. Oh. 
Right, we need need some help. That frightened the living daylights out of me. Uh, get rid of you. I don't think. Well, we keep the explosives. So I think I'm going to try and go for the direct route. I think you can see we've really woken up the bug uglies. I still didn't get help here. I think it's in the silver shade light. I'll hit that. Got them all. Yeah, I think I'm going to give it a go, guys. I'm, I'm not sure. I'll be completely upfront. I'm not 100% sure of the sequence, whether we can do it this way, but uh, I think if we can do it, it'd be quite good. What I'm going to do is come here. Now, there's a possibility that these ah no 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 Reload. Panic, 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 panic. Uh, Baron Root. Um, uh, we can get some bandages. I think I'm going to need some more bandages before I finish. <laughs> uh, vessel. Yeah, there's, there's these spawners in here that can be exciting. Two, three, four, five, fifteen. Got me to the floor. Right, make sure we're fully loaded. No more panicking. Oh, I did get a comment about reloading and what someone said is the loss of ammunition happens when you've got uh, something like this, the heavy laser that's got uh, actual charges in it. And if you load with a part charge, what will happen is that you will lose uh, the contents of that charge. Yeah, I think this is... Oh, no. I can't place item there. We'll do it physically. Wait, did we? Right, we've now blown our way in. You are down the end of here is going to be some uh, bug uglies. So what we're going to do is just want to do a weapons check and I'll be right back. Right, what we're going to do is go in with the... All right. <laughs> didn't last long did it we were shot by the infected i know there's a whole bunch of guys down in there that's why i was trying to use the uh, uh the what we call it the uh rocket launcher so here we are back back right there's a 
guy. One down. Of course, he got a couple of hits on me. got to do is whistle them down yeah, one over there uh, just load which uh, controller take the oxygen left and right what we're gonna do is rush past because that's the guy I'm hoping that it's the commander Just look round. Sometimes they get up here. But right, there's a loot box here. <laughs> I think this guy was a flamethrower. -y. Wow, what we got here? Personal shield generator. Haha, <laughs> uh, we might need that. Um, so, uh, so we might actually need that in what's just coming up. I don't know how long it's going to last. So, next thing we need to do is make sure we're fully loaded. Because what we got Hello. Oh <laughs> he was shot by infected. Luckily I didn't trigger the shield generator. Right, here we are, we're back in the center. Back. First thing we got to do is get rid of our friend in there. Make sure that way. Now we gotta go up to the end here. Now I'm gonna do there used there should be two volts. It's not up here. Okay. Uh what I'm do is trigger that. We gotta go into here. Here they come. <laughs> then he made it. 
I think that's an indicator that I've actually triggered the core destruction. But as you can see, uh, they all drop down, and there's a bit of a time lag with respect to how long it takes before they get it. But um, I'm, yeah, that was. Uh, imagine what's yeah, my armor's zero now. <laughs> okay. Now the problem we're going to get is. Yeah, I mean, all that lot. Do that. Ah, uh, whoops, no. My armor's trash. Probably I'm going to have to put an EVA boost on now. The reason for that is that when the call goes, we're going to be cold. So, uh, what we get here? Armor boosters can only be applied to advanced mobility. Okay, can't use that. Um, no, that give me a little bit of armor. It gives me 120. So, so what I'm going to do? There it goes. I don't know if you guys heard that explosion, but that should be the core gone. Yep, we've now destroyed the core, but. There's no way this place is friendly. Put it that way. Oops. I turn all the lights on. So that's how you destroy the core. Now the fun bit is that this place is still absolutely chock a block full of hostiles. So it's not an easy um, place to loot. So we go in through the roof. So probably the long and the short of this is the, the previous two parts doing things the hard way probably weren't that important. And you see, this place is going to be absolutely full of hostiles, which is going to be a bit of a problem. What we can do is I just want to show you where we, sh we should have gone. And I think I can do it from above. through here where are we see all the bug uglies here um, where are we oh we're gonna get a lot of that now anyway what we can do is uh, find the silver shade um, don't need those box there um, okay we don't need the advanced nanite ejectors as injectors now they can go in there we'll just keep that um that can go in the fridge that can go in the fridge put that in the fridge we can get rid of that main store set that when we as we go around picking things up we can put that out get rid of that um trade items in store she is happens an ammo isn't it sorry we got rocket launchers there right that's the room oops now well what I can do is show you through here Where is my, what happened to my multi-tool? I seem to have dropped my multi-tool somewhere. Um, probably out of panic. Oh no, I, it could be in the fridge. Yeah, put it in the fridge by accident. <laughs> uh, it's supposed to be like that. Yeah, advanced multi-tool. Okay. And I still didn't do the what I meant to set out, which is the silver shade lights. Don't need the rocket launcher. Put the core on. What we can do now is 
just show you what we've got in here. We've got um, fridges. Uh, actually, we'll do the fridges first because they can spoil. Um, compared to the fridge, freezer. You can see, oh, I don't know if you guys noticed, but it said 108. Um, <laughs> that one. Did the fridge. I wish there was a way. I wish this, this game would always remember where. Okay, so it's just the one. Right, next thing we'll do is just take out all the fuel. General supplies. 7,094. Pretty good. Uh, all the oxygen. You've got 8,990. That should give us yep, a lot of oxygen. And of course, as I, s I mentioned, well, we can do the ammo boxes. <laughs> um, get rid of the my controller. We'll put everything in here for the moment. Um, see what we've got. Yeah, I know they're all making a lot of noise. Very, very upset because I cheated. Uh, but uh, I'll be completely upfront. It, the process, I will describe it to you what you've got if you want to do it the hard way. But it is exactly that. It is a pretty tough run. Um, seven, eight, and nine. Ammunition controller here. More ammunition. That's quite nice. Uh, then we've got all these uh, cargo pallets in here. And if, we, if I show the front entrance, that's what we got to go for. Where the SV is. We come here. And what you've got is two quite large loops boxes in this area on this side so if we come in here you can see this goes down over two levels but it's going to be full of bug uglies we've got some nice loot here which we pick up this way i got a grenade launcher adding insult to injury <laughs> um yeah we just so what we can do is just loot at range now Means we don't have to shove it all into the back work. Okay. Got here. Oh, yeah. Gosh. Got some estrum. Oh, yes. Um, the reason I'm celebrating the estrum is that if we put that, sorry, because we going to cancel that into the main store. Oops, don't want that in there. We go to here. Hopefully it will give me enough to build a repair bay up. Come off it. Oh, we need Zarkosium now. <laughs> so we got Estrum, but uh, hopefully we might get some here. Anyway, let's get back to what I was talking about i think if we we go down on a think where this that's the room there so if we go this way actually what box of this tell us like Come into this. You see, this area is full of hostiles. Oh, that's the wrong way. Okay. <laughs> um. We need to. Not main store. Oh, well, I'm going to put everything in the ammunition controller to start with, and then we'll sort it out afterwards. I'm 
trying to work out where the floor plan is. Well, I'll just show you the other side as well. Um, so, uh, it's nice, nice, hard, and still blocks here. Uh, I think we'll take a few of these so I can reinforce the ship. And in here, I don't think there's any bug uglies up here. Right, chamber. Player. Okay, we're out of range of the capital vessel over here, so um, it's a salvage mode. I'm just going to do this so I know what I have done and haven't done. Okay, you're right to leave logistics range. Thank you. Right, we've got go this way. I'm um, gonna take this get to you get to you. Mission. Got gun shells. Nickel cabinet. Oops, missed something. Some plants. Actually I think we can open this. And then oh, try and stand in a corner here. Oh, come on, game. Somebody's just fired at us, I think. And what we got down. Yep, there's somebody down there. <laughs> um, here we got all these uh, loot boxes. Anyway. Let's just see if we can get back. Oh, no, we got. I'll take you. These as well. And this look will look like a familiar door because this is the where we came through before. We cleared all this area. See, this is just part of this area here. Right, let me just see if I can find the room. Where we've got to go down. Hello. I just want to. Covers all the tunnels look the same, and I don't really want to. Oops. Need to do that. Let me just empty this out. So that back, need it. Put that there. Put that there. Um, don't need the cargo box. Just, I pack this up with uh, stuff. The stuff we've looted will come down the bottom there. Hey, let me just. Oops. No, 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 no. Right, let's. Okay, we're gonna have to do it the other way. Right? Over here. And come down this level. So hole here which we come through this is the this brings us back into this room now that room goes that way so maybe the room I'm looking for is actually over here so if we go to that corner we go down there Uh, here we are this is what i'm looking for now if you were going to do the, the long way 
what you would do is you'd come down into here and at the back of here is a switch there's also two very nice loot boxes here that's what i was really after oh yeah the estrum can go there Brilliant, but take it. So this is the room you've got to get into. I don't think there's anything else. Yeah, there's a lot of bug uglies. So there's bug uglies everywhere. Um, I don't think there's anything in here. I think it's just, well, I should find those heavyweight armored windows. They're a nice win. Now, if we go back out the door and go round, where is it? In through here. Up here is another loot box. And this is on the other side of the wall. Ah, oh, Zocosium, yes. Uh, okay. uh, that might be what I'm looking for. That there. Oh. So, so that's the switch you've got to get to. If you want to do it the hard way. And of course what you'd have is this entrance here. This is where the turret is. There's no loot down here. But this is where the um, stun turret would be. And then to store and take. What you'd have to do is fight your way up here to where our lovely friendly that's the tunnel yeah. okay. okay we're running out of oxygen <laughs> but now i've got that sarcosium um full vessel bridge fridge uh, in store i put that in there that in there it's just empty this out Actually, we're Go back to the vessel. Um, okay. Capital vessels up over here. Let's get this going now. I go to main store. If I'm very upset, I uh, bridge main store. If I can do this. This will make yes. That's it. Okay, I'm just going to go up over there. Yeah, to the capital vessel. Put it this way, finding that Zocosium Estrum and being able to make a repair bay makes the whole excapade worthwhile. Because now we've got a repair bay. One, it means we can repair our weapons, but more importantly, we can repair our armor without having to run around everywhere. Um, just need to, I think we've got some space here. Uh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Whoops. Rooms as well, and the berries, the food supply going as well. I think I'm going to need a second fridge actually. I keep saying that, I think what I will do, I'll make a second fridge. Um, I could have got a fridge from the place, but. Bridges aren't exactly something that's very expensive to move, make. So, what we'll do is just pick up our armor. Be the first thing we're going to repair. Yeah. 
camp. Roll up. In there. There, I love that. YouTube while I'm at it. Combat shotgun, well, as well. I don't think anything else really needs to prepare just at the moment. Yeah. That is a big step forward. And something to eat. Yeah. Um, do, 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 main store. Oh, the fridge. Where we go? Um, I'm gonna put the heavy armor in there for the moment. Um, not gonna be fighting, so get pack booster. We're going to go into quite a lengthy loot phase now. I'm sticking with the light armor simply because uh, we should be okay. Temperature one. Got the EVA boost on. And I'm going to try and keep the exposure to hostiles um, relatively short because I wasn't overly oppressed with the loot that we were getting from them. So, and the one place we haven't been, which is, I think it's up in this tower here. So we will go and take a look at this tower here. I'm not sure if there's any loot in there here, but I'm going to, um, yeah, ammunition controller, let's put that on. I wouldn't find these heavy windows. Now, this area here. Okay. I think this is the. Now, if you go back two parts, there's a, a place where I said there's a. You don't need to go or bother going up, and I think it's this area here. It's this area here. Oh. Where are we? <laughs> Don't recognise this place. Um okay. That's where are we? Um oh we're in the tower here okay there is the tower I'm sure that was the tower let me just see uh pick out it's the room let's just do it again wow okay Didn't mean to do that. Well, we'll take that. This is a part of the building I don't recall being into. Uh, I'll be completely up front. It's an, an area where maybe that, that's the entrance there. I'm trying to find the problem is it's the the building okay a uh, motorbike oh yeah this is the yeah it's not the place where i thought it was this is the this is the back of the building and you've got this up here which takes you up into the tower 
Yes, that's not the way I thought I was. Um, I, I think it's we come round here. Okay, let me just get to, I think maybe it's up here then. What I'm thinking of. Uh, let's just follow the follow the actual path round that we took in the early part of the game. Come down here. That's it. I'm. Um, I'm on the path now. Now we're losing contact with the drone. Okay. Um, it's we went round that way, didn't we? So if I stand here, this this is where we came in. The entrance. Where is it? around here that's it you just that is this is that tower okay <laughs> um that's the other side of it uh we'll retrieve that armored door i might i will get there guys I promise that's it this is where we come up here. This is the area where I said it's not worth coming up here. As far as I know, there's nothing of any great value up here beyond grief. Oh, so maybe this is another entrance into the... Yes, yeah, so you come up here come into here so this is another entrance into this upper part of the building um take that go there a large generator would be quite nice and then you come around here then you'd go into here you come up to here to so say as far as i know there's just lots of combat but not anything oh great Last door. Okay. Wow. Okay. We're... This takes you to the outside. Uh, what we're... So, for any of your buddies optimistic and wants to come through there, um, have a blast door there. The blast doors could be quite useful to have. Um, so, as far as I know, I've covered all the main loot boxes there but um and that just leaves me with the unenviable task of uh looting down 108 uh container controllers so that is something I'll do off camera. This is where I'm going to leave it. Hope you enjoyed the episode. Hope you found it interesting. Any other suggestions about loot, um, loot storage in this uh, POI, feel free to chuck it in the comments. And until next time, whatever you do, enjoy your gaming.